On November 4, 2020, the Lagos State Ministry of Physical Planning and Urban Development served notices to operators of tank farms in Oria, the local council development area, over their illegal activities within residential area. About a year later, the Lagos State Physical Planning Permit Authority visited the area and discovered some operators are yet to comply with the agency's order. This is massive. So can you imagine that none, apart from those two that has expressed interest to regularize their papers, the remaining 14, they don't care. And we cannot continue to allow this to continue. If they, I mean, all of them have shown their new interest, I've been coming forward to come and regularize. We, we prefer voluntary compliance. We don't, I mean, we're only compelled to, I mean, to adopt this type of, I mean, approach when people feel that they're above the law and they're untouchable, nothing can happen. But we can't continue. This is our legal, this is our dear state. Hearing operators are warned not to cause forceful enforcement from the agency. Some of these tank farms are not even supposed to be located within these I mean, residential environments. But here we are, this situation we find ourselves. But however, we still have to do the right thing. We have to sanitize, we have to ensure that the right thing are done. If they have come forward to us, they I mean, we have been able to advise them. Government, legacy government is ready to regularize some of them that are possible to exist. We will do that. The general manager also appealed to tank farm owners in Ijegu, Apapa and Kirikiri to visit the agency's office for the regularization of their activities. Malgbe Jasu, LTV News.